What's up everyone? John Brittinger from Techno Buffalo here with an unboxing of this gigantic box. It is the NVIDIA Shield. I'm really excited to take a look at this guy. It is the flagship Tegra 4 tablet gaming console, kind of everything crammed into one. Let's go ahead and unbox it and take a first look. So here is the giant box to NVIDIA Shield. I assume this is a press box and not the retail packaging, but we will see. Uh, on top, you've got the NVIDIA Shield logo, and it kind of looks like it's got an Iron Man helmet inside of it. We'll go ahead and pull off this gigantic cardboard top. And inside, oh, that must be the retail packaging. There is NVIDIA Shield. Go ahead and pull this out. That would be what you expect to uh, get when you place your order for $299. Push it off the side for just a second. Looks like the folks in NVIDIA hooked us up with a few other things. Got a $50 Google Play gift card in there and a 32 gig micro SD card. There's some more goodies at the bottom. We've got a NVIDIA Shield carrying case. That was nice of uh, those folks. We're not gonna break our NVIDIA Shield, but that's not the reason you are here. This is the reason you are here. I'm really excited to take a look at this guy. Go ahead and slide that top part off. Looks like the box kind of opened on its own. And there is the NVIDIA Shield. Go ahead and pull it out. And it's connected to some other stuff. Push it off to the side for just a second. The packaging here is really nice. Uh, we've got some information on the Shield. Looks like it's a user's guide, how to, what everything does, and all the trigger buttons, registration and warranty. Uh, also in there. Charging cable, it's just a standard uh, micro USB, but it does have the NVIDIA Shield logo on it, that's kind of cool. And then just a pretty standard uh, NVIDIA branded wall wart with the prongs that flip out. Nothing overly exciting there. This though, this is where all the action happens. Here is the NVIDIA Shield. Go ahead and pull this thing off. This guy does a ton of things, uh, aside from being sort of a full functional Android tablet. Go ahead and pull all this stuff off. Um, all right, so let me remind you what the specs are of the NVIDIA Shield. You're looking here is a five inch screen with a 1280 by 720 display uh, with a 294 PPI. And I'll pull off the sticker so we can get rid of that, letting you know it's a touch screen. You've got pretty much pure unadulterated Android and I believe it is 4.2.2, but there's really just one way to tech that out. 4.2.1. Uh, is shipping uh, out of the box here. So we'll go ahead and go home, which I believe is that button right there. And again, powered by Tegra 4. Uh, it's got 16 gigs of built-in storage. Uh, 802.11n uh, is here as well. Uh, Bluetooth, of course, no NFC, 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, these crazy awesome speakers, uh, and all kinds of other goodness. So let's go ahead and talk about what this thing can do. Uh, so of course, it can play games. I uh, can play games downloaded from NVIDIA's Tegra Zone, uh, which are pretty solid games. I uh, can also play PC games uh, that can be streamed over Wi-Fi. And this is still in beta, I believe. We're not connected to Wi-Fi yet, obviously, but we will in just a second. Take a look at some of those. Uh, you could also stream Steam games from your home PC. Uh, you could install emulators and play older games. You could really do almost anything with this guy. In addition, it is a full-on Android tablet, so really you can do anything on it you can do with Android. Uh, and it feels really, really nice in the hand. Uh, it feels like a flatter Xbox 360 controller. Um, all the buttons have really nice throw to them. They feel much better than it did when I saw the pre-production unit uh, actually at WWDC a few months back. I'll close this up and see what else we're going to have on it. There are a few trigger buttons uh, as well. So you've got two on the left, two on the right. There's your headphone jack, there's your charging port, HDMI out. And if you want to expand the storage, you can do that right there with that uh, included uh, micro SD card. It was included in our package, not sure if that's going to be included in retail. And you've got a fan right there. Uh, it's a little bit of a soft touch feel on it and it feels really, really nice. So I'm going to go ahead and connect this guy to Wi-Fi and give it some tests, run it through some benchmarks. Uh, and see if it's worth your money. It's a pretty reasonable price at $299. It was initially supposed to be $350, but Nvidia said consumers said it'd be a better price to win $50 less. So I give them credit because they did lower it. You don't see that happen very often. Uh, so very curious to try this guy out and see how it performs. Anything you want to see on the Nvidia Shield, be sure to leave us in that in the comments down below. I love to hear your thoughts. Give this video a thumbs up. We'll definitely appreciate it. I am John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. What's up everyone, it's Ashley. Thanks so much for watching that most recent video. If you enjoyed it, please click on the word subscribe right underneath me to get tons more tech videos from us here at Techno Buffalo. We have got 
unboxings, comparisons, reviews, recaps, and everything else you can think of here on the channel. Now, if you're in the mood for more technology, just click right over here to check out some of our most recent videos. See you next time, humans.